This is mushrooms on toast for the first time. And if I'm honest, I thought this would be a more simple recipe. You never know until you dig in, right? It almost has a meaty texture to it. Meaty flavor. I think it's probably coming from the mushrooms, for one. Because they're so umami. But also the uh, all the thyme and garlic shallots and the thyme cooking it down adds to the complexity of the flavor. It's pretty good. What I had imagined uh, mushrooms on toast was essentially just frying up mushrooms in butter and then putting it on toast. And maybe it is. I don't actually know. Somebody's actually going to have to tell me because I looked at about a dozen recipes and then I extrapolated what I enjoyed and threw away what I did not enjoy. That's what we have here. We have mushrooms on toast in all of the ways that I thought I would enjoy it. And I'm right. I enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> I think I may have overdone it with the uh, the portion size. It appears there's much more mushroom than there is toast. I don't think I would go with pre-sliced bread again. I don't usually. I got it for a different video. Decided to do a couple British dishes before I used up the entire thing of bread making stupid sandwiches. I would probably enjoy this more on a sourdough or a French bro uh, French loaf and much thicker or less mushrooms. This is crazy. Don't get me wrong. This is really good. Probably not something I would have came up with on my own. Actually, I had this weird little stint when I was probably 13 or 14 where I would, everything was bread. I can't tell you what I did with it other than I remember deep frying it and remembering that was bad. Or maybe was I just excited about it with the deep fryer. On my own, I may not have ever came up with this idea. Now that I know about this, I know how complex you can make it. I might add this to my uh, my arsenal. I think I probably made this for like a dollar twenty-five a portion. If I take out the wine, it's probably a dollar a portion. I probably could go with a cheaper and better piece of bread. Probably get that down a little bit further too. Hmm. I just had a really dumb thought. I could get this down even further because. I could go to the compost pile at the mushroom factory and get mushrooms for free. I could bring this cost down to <laughs> like 10 cents a portion. I don't think too many people are excited about foraging a compost pile. When I went there looking for soil to uh, grow my potatoes and stuff, yes, my balcony potatoes, they were delicious. There were, there were mushrooms in there. I don't know, probably probably 15 or 20 minutes I could probably come up with enough to make this fish. They're not old, they're not rotten, they were just missed in the process. Okay, bye!